Hey team, good afternoon, good afternoon. This is Prince. How's everybody doing? Just a quick, very quick video I want to do on the crudel. This is 21 range chart. All right. Now, we have an official entry 103.77 short. Let's look at the 21 range chart quickly. We are above the 144 moving average and we are chopping at the highs. It has been crappy last three working days were really shit on the crude oil market. We had one high. Okay, then the following day the sellers, the buyers failed to make a new high and the sellers also make uh, failed to make a new low. Can you see it? Here, all right. Then on the third day before, uh, on the Friday, uh, we had a new high just by 28 cents, but just by 30 cents. Okay, 0.3% increase in price and again the buyers fail and the sellers are trying to take the price all the way down. But anyway, who gives a shit? All right, we have to uh, make the bucks anyway. All right, whatever happens, we just we need the volatility to come back in the market. 103.77 is a short. Let's look where we should exit the trade. There are many ways to exit the trade. First of all, where's 103.77? Let's see, I didn't find it here. 103.77, all right? This was the reason, an M pattern. Here, we took the short, but the sellers failed and the trade turned against us. Now, there are many ways to uh, exit it. First, you can exit at the 144 moving average here on the 21 range chart. You can use it as a target, 86 ticks. Or you can just be quiet, shut your mouth, be patient, and exit the trade at the next level here, 101.68. Manage your risk accordingly. You can make it like, you know, if market goes from 104 to 101, you want to gain 2%, 3%, 5%, you just determine what you want. 10%, 20%, 30%, all on your risk tolerance. And I don't know if 1% loss scares you or a 5% loss scares you or 10% loss scares you. If anything less than 1% scares you, then the trading is not good. You should switch. To, you should think of working at McDonald's or something. Just I'm kidding, all right? Now, another way to trade. Let's go to the 8 range chart, okay? If you're not concentrating on the moving averages, 103.77 is of course a short trade. We have a support here. The next support is at 101.68 here. All right. So what you can do is hold this trade from 103.77. Okay. It's like a nice 200 tick trade, 209 tick trade. Can you see that? Yeah. All right. And you can exit the trade here. Now the next trade you could take like is you can draw another support level here. If the market is not reversed towards the upside, you can put a sell stop, not at 101.25, let, let's say 101 even, okay, if the market is really, 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 really bearish, okay, 101 would be your fill, and you could sh uh, hold this baby all the way down till this support area, uh, 101, yeah, 101, till this, 100.34, and then there is here, okay, so these are your targets, and sell entries as well, both of them. All right, I hope this video helps. If you have any questions, feel free to post on the Skype room and I'll be glad to answer them for you. Have a great trading day, have a great trading week. We really don't need everyday trading videos on analysis on oil, okay? So I hope this video helps, all right? I appreciate your feedback. If you'll give me your feedback and what you think about the videos, it will really help me improve further in making better videos for you and educating you and training you, all right? So yeah, this is Prince. Have a lovely trading day. I'm out. Bye-bye for now.